So I don't talk about the fitness bullshit much anymore. I really don't because it's all bullshit. Like we've reached a stage in society where we are so obese, so fat, so sedentary that it's threatening society. We actually locked the country down for it in 2020 as a stated reason. You can check on that. It's because we had so many immunocompromised people. It was actually stated. So I'm going to focus on that. The majority, because I believe that that's where my talents as like the and my skills and talents as a weight loss coach which by the way I'll check out the description box below we are running an all-in year special and it's going to go fast the very 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 limited spots but i think my talents are best trying to help people get healthy you know uh i don't even like worry about bodybuilding or anything like that very much and i never really really have just to be fucking real and everybody knows that right but for some reason, I keep getting, like, I've gotten like a dozen or two emails and messages about this Chris Bumstead guy and the rumors about Chris Bumstead. One, just got to be real, I had to look him up. I, 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 I don't keep up with bodybuilding. I, I don't give a fuck. I got to be real. I don't give a fuck. Even my bodybuilder friends know, and, and I've, I, it's not that healthy, and I'm focused on people's health. I personally downsized probably 10 pounds of muscle in this last year to be healthier. So I truly do not give a fuck about your bodybuilding crushes. I really don't. But... I just wanted to remind all of you that really go towards like the rumors about ped use uh, about this guy, which is stupid. Like if you don't like, it's dumb. Don't, it's so stupid that you even like there's rumors. I think he even has admitted it from what I've understood. But the very second that you come looking for, what do you think about this person's natty status? Or what do you think about this person's rumors about their use? Blah, blah, blah. You might as well just like admit that your penis is so small. It's damn near an any, it, it really sounds like that. What the fuck is wrong with you? Like if you think it's an unrealistic expectation, I can guarantee fucking to you this no matter what it is like even if you use the same shit that guy used it's an unrealistic expectation because you're a pussy i'm just going to be fucking straight up worry about you be consistent most of you motherfuckers want to work out two or three weeks really hard in the fucking gym and wonder where your fucking abs are at meanwhile work out for 30 fucking years work out for 10 fucking years consistently with high intensity watch your nutrition consistently like you don't have like a spare body motherfuckers most of you motherfuckers should worry about your generalized health than whether you're going to fucking have six pack abs or look like Chris Bumstead. It's ridiculous. The motherfuckers that make their channels off Natty or Nots, you look stupid too. You look like bitches. I'm just going to be real. Like, actually be a real fucking man and take your fucking responsibility of your own fucking body and your own fucking hands. Don't believe any of the shit you see. And I've, I've said it for fucking years. Don't believe any of the shit you see here. None of it. None of it. Don't believe anything you see behind a fucking screen for any fucking YouTuber on any fucking subject. Don't believe it. Do your own fucking research. And make sure, even if it comes out of their mouth, research it to the source data, not just what the fucking person says or an article. Go to the fucking studies, read the study. If you don't understand the study, try to fucking learn the terms in the study so you can fucking understand what the fuck's going on. But asking about other people's natty status, you guys just look like a bunch of bitches. 